up? It is me, Adolf 700 here, and we're back with Legend of Zelda, the Phantom Hourglass. We're going to start. We left off. We are just about to go to her Grandpa Oshua's place, which is all the way up here. Annoying. And he's old. You'll see what I mean. And we have a fairy buddy. If you watched my last video, you'd know. It's just, that was just a... Here, let's talk to him. Celia flying around. Oh, that's a weird walking stick. Oh, hello, traveler. So your name is Link. He didn't say anything. Neither did Celia. What the, f the fuck? Sorry about that. I am Oshua, and I live on this island. Celia told me all about what happened to you. I also hear your friend was taken by the ghost ship. Yep. I understand that you want to find the ghost ship, but you must not. What? But Grandpa, what are you saying? Link's friend was carried away. Sorry. Pure evil feels the sails of the ghost ship. It roams the seas in search of victims to capture. And no one has ever escaped from it. It is best if you stay far, far away from the ghost ship. No, to seek out the ghost ship is to seek out your doom. That's why we have to do something, Grandpa. Oh, mercy. Hmm. You're not going to give up, are you? Give up, Link, now. Young people these days. They never learn. I know what you need. I know. There is a port to the east of here. A sailor by the name of Linebeck should be there. He'll be waiting to tell you more about the ghost ship. Look at your map. There's a harbor here. And on your map, it'll show the harbor. It's the very, very bottom left. No, bottom right, excuse me. The bottom right of your map. You mean that guy who came to visit Grandpa? He asked about the ghost ship. I remember him. I'll go with Link and show him who he is. It's okay, right, Grandpa? Yes, I don't see why you can't go along. I'm sure you can help Link. Listen. Listen. Sorry. Thank you, Grandpa. Let's go, Link. Annoying fairy. She's always been antsy, that one. Now, Link. Hey, there have been many monster sites. I gave in to you and told you about Linebeck, but you be careful out there. You know, I was wondering this. What happened to Link's sword? I mean, he could have lost it in the ocean, but I doubt that. Because it's kind of connected to him by a strap. Oh, no, an earthquake. What's that rumbling? Another earthquake? So many quakes lately. So many monsters. Bad signs for sure. And I bet there are even worse things to come. Alright. What you do is you go all the way up here. And well the bridge is broken. You can't cross. So you can. You don't have to talk to this person. It's optional. But I want to. Oh heavens. That quake just broke the bridge again. So many quakes lately. And the bridge breaks every time there's a big one. There's a second way to get, in get to town unfortunately. Fortunately. Unfortunately it leads to a frightening cave full of monsters. What to do? Well, wait for the bridge to be fixed, of course. Now she tells you about the other way in. And if you go talk to Grandpa Oshua again, he'll also tell you about that same way. So the earthquake broke the bridge, did it? Ah, unfortunate. There's another way to the port, but it's far too dangerous. No, wait for someone to reel the bridge. That's the only safe course. Don't even think about braving the path to the north. Well, if you didn't want us to go there, you shouldn't have told us where the path was. We go up here, go into here, go over here, and <gasps> look, chew jellies! Monsters, look out, Link! It's a way too dangerous. We need something to defend yourself with. You have to go back. 
Sanders, take this with you. Yeah, links in the past. Yeah. Now you go to talk to Grandpa Ashu again. It's actually very repetitive at this part, but don't worry. We'll get into sword soon. Hopefully in this video. Hopefully. Treasure the path north, did you? Celia, don't pretend you forgot. I told you never to go that way. We've seen so many quakes rattle the island lately, Link. And monsters have been seen closer and closer to town. Be cautious, young ones. That cave up to the north leads to the port, it's true. But that path will be crawling with monsters. Do not even think of it. I'm sure someone will get around repairing the bridge. Nope. At least not till we're done with the cave. I'll tell you, you cross. Well, Grandpa wants us to stay out of trouble, but we need to find your friend. If only we found a sword, then you could show these monsters. And I'll show you where this sword is. The stupidest place to hide a sword. Where kids can find it. Like Link. Like Link. Alright, here we go. Another cutscene. Grandpa used this cave as his storehouse. I think I remember Grandpa storing a sword back there. No, no, how to get this door open. I remember the cracks the door by writing a number on the side. I think he said it's the number of palm trees on the beach. Sneaky. Uh, I count. I already know how many there are on the beach. There's. If you want to, you can. It doesn't matter. There's seven on the beach. Well, this side of the beach. And there's more over here. I think at least one more, but doesn't matter. And we got the sword. Good for us, though. Now we can defend ourselves from those monsters. Yes, we have the sword. Actually, this I'll see the number seven started on there. Oh, how do you find us? Impossible. You two are proving me quite a handful. It is not my sword. What do you plan on doing then? Not stabbing you in the face? Grandpa, I'm sorry, but we just had to. We can't abandon this kidnap room. We can't wait for the bridge. Yes, I understand, but I can't just let you go. Now without showing you how to handle that sword. You know, Link did save Princess Zelda from the Dark King. I think he knows how to use a sword. I'll teach you how to handle it. Meet me at my house, Link. And then we break away and magically come here. Link. So you have a sword. Then know that even the best swords can be bad. We know we used to have a master sword and a good shield. If must handle that is, so oh, I must teach you the basics of sword. No, you don't. Let's begin with a targeted attack. It's the easiest attack in the game. Probably the most effective. I'm going to bring out some targets for sword practice. Far safer than the real foes. Step a target to lock on and close in and close in for an attack. Try it now. Ha ah. ah. ha ah. ha Yeah Excellent. The target attacks are the most basic attacks. Use it well. Now for the side slash. When you find it hard to lock on enemies, use the side slash instead. Just sketch a line that divides you and your target to slash it. This move requires a little practice. Simply sketch to slash. There we go. It's easier with the mouse on the trackpad. Looks like you fully understand the side slash. You can also use it to slash several things at once. Remember it well. That'll do. And finally, we have the spin attack. Slide the stylus in a circle around yourself to spin the attack link or mouse cruiser if you're using an emulator. Uh, I think this is all we're going to get to uh, after we're doing this. Oh! So, yes, this will happen. The target will magically reappear. Superb, I can teach you nothing more. Now you must swim on your own as you adventure among the monsters. But if you do have any problems, return here and speak with me. Yes, sir. Well, guys, we're going to have to end this off here. We're at the time limit. Uh, next video, I'll show you the cave. 
and lineback. Probably pretty funny. Alright, I'll see you guys next time. Whee!